I could write you a song to make you fall in love I would already have you up under my arm I used to ball of my tricks I hope that you like this But you probably won't You think you're cool with me Okay, once you have taken out your SD card from your SD card reader, you'll open it, open the back, and put the SD card back in your SD card slot. And cover it. And put your phone on. And then you go to File Explorer and on, go to Storage Card. And then you click the Android, the Android folder. And first you click C L R C A D. And then you click Harrit, and it's gonna boot. This is going to take a couple of minutes, so you have to wait. I'm not responsible if your phone gets bricked. Okay, the HTC screen came out, and now it's going to boot Android, as you can see. And it's really simple to do this. It's not that hard. It's not like doing custom firmware for PSP. Or doing some other special stuff you geeks know out there. But it's really simple. It's really easy. And once this is done booting, I'll show you. See? I've already used it. That's why I didn't go through setup. And basically, this is what it is. I have to wait for the loading sometimes. And... I'll show you. See, it has like almost everything here. It has this. It ha you have this. You have live wallpapers. I have some trouble with the calling. Like, this speaker up here doesn't work. I hear a buzzing so sound. And this is your apps. Currently, the market is working, but. If you try to download Angry Birds, because it's most known, it won't actually work. Or if you know any other special method. So yeah, that's it. This is how to run the operating system Android on your HTC HD2. Oh yes, and the camera fully works. See? It fully works. And... Internet works, your messages, email, and in order to have service on your phone, on the Android, you need to first have your SIM card in your HTC HD2 before doing this. And when you restart, it's going to, when you restart, you're going to go back to normal Windows, and you're going to have to go back to the same folder and do the CLRCAD folder and then the Harrit again and this will do the same booter process and that's it